Okay, I'll just quickly show you how you apply the Ultra Key effect in Adobe Premiere Pro CC to remove the green screen. So you can see now there's a clip with me and a green screen behind me. So it's in the effects panel that you find Ultra Key. So I click on effects here and I've already searched for Ultra recently. So I've got it showing there. Ultra Key is the effect. So you click and drag that over to the clip on the timeline which you want to apply and then you let go. Then you come up to effect controls and you will see there's an ultra key section and there's a little eyedropper so you click the eyedropper so you click the eyedropper and then click on the background and then as you see the green has disappeared and it's now black so there are settings in the ultra key setup and you can adjust spill suppression and matte generation, transparency, tolerance and all of those things. So quite often I'll adjust the pedestal setting and drag it up. But it's easier to see if you click on the composite and then alpha channel setting. And as you can see there's a black and white view and what you want is all black out here and all white on the subject so I'll adjust the pedestal and you can see that pretty much gets it all black tolerance slide up and down doesn't do much shadow you can adjust it comes back and it's gone okay so now I've got good looking alpha channel switch it back to composite there's a tiny bit of green tinge, but I'll just leave that for now. So now what you need is, or you can have a black background if you want. Or you can bring in a background, which is mostly what you want to do. So I've got a sunset, which I'll drag over. So I actually need to move my clip up on the timeline and then take the background below and there you go just stretch it out and you now see I've got a background behind me and play the video and you can see the effect so that's the green screen effect using ultra key in Adobe Premiere Pro